Hi everyone, so today I just want to show you what is the meta gears and pets in the game Adventure. So I've been playing this game for a while. Uh, as you can see here, this is my current gear uh, and this is considered to be one of the meta gears. There are two meta gears that, you know, that is agreed by most people. So I'm going to go over both of them and also a third one that's, in my opinion, probably the closest third meta you know compared to the other two so anyway let's get started so this is considered to be the metal one which consists of the robot head the black belt and two laser guns for the pets is panda plus dark horse or you can also get the turtle which you know which is the same as the dark horse uh, and this one gives you basically uh, all workers walk 396 percent faster um customer orders instantly Perfect food is worth times two more. All workers plus 90% chance to make the perfect food. And all workers plus 120% chance to make food instantly. Um, so this is meta one is agreed by most people that this is the best setup in the game currently. And I agree with that. So 100% chance to make food instantly. However, perfect food is 90%. It's not 100%, but it's still good enough you know you miss 10 percent, but it makes up by the walk speed so the walking speed is crazy is plus 396 percent for all workers so this is what it makes up for the 10 percent uh, loss in perfect food and of course the customer order instantly and perfect food is worth times two more that's from the pets which is you know the meta pets for end game and uh, now what about the second meta so i'm going to show you right now i have that as well so this is currently the second meta which consists of the robot head the shock body laser gun and the scepter or actually you can switch out the scepter with either the pickaxe or the anchor it would give you the same result so it doesn't matter so anyway what does this give you it gives you all worker plus 110 percent chance to make food instantly all workers walk 206 percent faster and all workers plus 120 percent chance to make perfect food so this one actually gives you uh, over 100 percent chance to make perfect food that does that's the main difference however um this one also i mean this one of course also gives you 100 percent instant food but the walking speed is a lot slower than meta one so all workers walk plus 206 percent faster meta one walks 396 percent so almost double the speed of this one that's why this one is considered to be meta two or at least maybe not as good as the first meta however i would say this one may not be as bad as you think especially maybe in some levels such as the mines because in mines walk speed is not as important than in other levels so in mines you have the mine cards those are the bottleneck it will slow you down um, so maybe in that level, maybe I'm just assuming this build might be better than meta one and also shock body. It's an ultimate. So it gives you higher, uh, all profit boost than the black belt. Um, but however, in end game, it doesn't matter that much because it only gives you around 1700%. So if you have, let's say 10,000% of all profit, I mean, 1700 is not as much compared to the walk speed because the black belt one it gives you twice as much walk speed and that means you can deliver more dishes than meta two so that's why meta one is considered to be better but feel free to leave your opinion nothing is wrong between those two i mean even this one i would agree is very good and then the last thing i want to say is the third meta which i'm going to show you right now nobody ever mentioned this everyone is just going to say two matters um but in my opinion this might be the third meta but however i have to agree i have to admit this is not as good as meta one and meta two because this one doesn't give you any instant food however uh, even though without instant food, it still gives you faster food, which is uh, our worker make food plus 200% faster. Um, so this one consists of the torch helmet, uh, the black belt, and two scepters. Same thing for the pets. Um, so basically, uh, all workers walk plus 430% faster. 
and then all workers plus 100% chance to make perfect food and all workers make food plus 200% faster. So again, no instant food, but you make that up by 200% faster food. Um, and this one has 100% perfect food, so slightly more than the metal one. And this one walks even faster than metal one. It's plus 430% faster. Um, so that's why in my opinion, this is the third meta, even though nobody ever mentioned that because I guess people don't like it when there's no instant food. But this one will still make it up a little bit, plus 200% faster food. And don't forget, if you're doing solo, if you're, only, if you're not hiring any other chefs, this one is even better than both metas because this one... Uh, for solo, you get 180% chance to prepare food instantly. Not other worker, but yourself. So you, if you're just playing with your own chef, then this one gives you 100% instant food and 100% perfect food and walks plus 430% faster. This is better than both meta 1 and meta 2 if you are just doing solo. Um, but if you're hiring other workers, this is... Probably not as good as the other two, but still, this one is probably the closest um, setup compared to the other two. I don't think there's any other setup that come close. Um, and, you know, don't forget this one walks even faster and 100% perfect food. It's just, you know, the 200% faster food may not be as good in the big restaurant or in the event. So anyway, uh, feel free to leave your comment on, you know, the Meta Gears. Um, and what's your opinion on a third or even a fourth meta? So anyway, thanks for watching and have a nice day.